Hello sweetie, I got there. Don't um, waste our time and let's go for the next part. On the Walking Dead. Let's and check. his college degree. These boys aren't stupid. And his baseball trophy. Mm. Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. The dairy must have meant a lot to them before the walkers destroyed everything. High school diploma. This must be Terry. Husband. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Pads. I could use a shave. Some kind of lotion. I don't want to really wash my hand. I am too curious. so much morphine for candles smart musty as hell I guess someone needed some first aid recently uh, yeah mark <laughs> yeah, what is this stuff looks like a bunch of medical waste in here IV tubes saline what would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff huh, where is that cord going that cord going? Okay. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Feels like there's a storm coming. Is that blood? Books. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. 
Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It didn't have to be this way. You're eating human meat! That's crazy. What the hell? I <laughs> scare the kids, Lee. <laughs> Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Quiet. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head! Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't wanna die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something! Lee? Lee? Ah! I'll kill you! Did, God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Dad, Don't give please. up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down! Oh, I'll rip your goddamn heads off and make you swallow Don't. them! Uh, I don't want to know what kind. Come on! Try yourself! Coward! Dad! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. There's more of us on the way! They got caught you in dust, Lee! Now. Those fuckers have you my family! I know! Not We're gonna, gonna get out of here and find them! They're not gonna open the door! Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking Dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! Dad, this isn't helping! Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention, so I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your <laughs> problem? You were a prick back at the motor lodge, 
And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. <laughs> don't forget, I know who you really are. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, 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 easy! Uh, oh, oh, God. Dad? <gasps> no! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Oh, Think God. about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six-foot-four, three-hundred-pound, seriously pissed-off dead guy! Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later, but right now we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could, believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Oh, Wake oh, up! No. Come on! Lee! Is he breathing at all? No! No, I don't think so! Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all of us at risk, you son of a bitch! What? You're fucking worthless, Lee. Free! It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? I don't know. One of the brothers could come back any second. We need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. <sighs> Talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Duck? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have... No! They, they need Katja, remember? Well, she's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. Look, if we're gonna survive this shit, we got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. What 
now. What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. And yes, fuck, we, we could try to save him. We don't we didn't didn't have the proof he's dead. Not immediately. Oh. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Not immediately. We we could we could wait. Just a little. He was still lively. He was still alive. We don't know, but you've got to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. <laughs> oh fuck! I'm sorry, Lily. I didn't want to save him, but I wanted to try. That's all. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm-mm. -mm. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. It's not coming off that way. Please, I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. Do what you have to do. You, uh, want to do the honors and search Larry's pockets? <laughs> I'm not going near Lily. Not now. If somebody's got to search his pockets, it better be you. <laughs> Which pocket he keeps his change in? Poor girl, it was this father. So hard to take a choice like this. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. I couldn't kill him like this. He was still lively. He was still alive. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Ready, let's go. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Do it by yourself. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Can't tell. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. My girl, don't talk You're to her. Be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Oh, 
lost. If it was your son, seriously. So easy. Give anybody nightmares. Jesus, is this is where they butcher people. Sick bastards, all of them. Yeah. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. Outside the bar. Oh, shit. Just guard in the place, like you said. Uh, sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Get one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep? Not the kid. I mean, the leader of the trade. He's inside. He's the uh, guy. Oh, I know, Mother. This is my favorite part, too. When I let one think they can take him out together, right out. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't know the real reason he's gonna walk past us. Fucker, we can take him out when his back is to the sun. Let's see what he's doing now. Lee. What? I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. What? What? Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what? 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 Okay. 
what this coward? Coward. What friend? Huh. Incredible. You see? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Mark never volunteered to be food! You gotta keep me alive! If you kill me, the meat gets tainted! You can't eat it! You're already tainted! You ain't gonna kill me! Just like you didn't kill Jolene! You don't have what it takes! <laughs> fucking coward! Ah! This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you! Go. I'll cover you. Just stay here and keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back. I begin to regret to don't kill the guy. He's with my girl. Uh -oh. <gasps> oh. oh, nice. Nice. Carly. Me? been gone way too long. We need your help. Yeah, when you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, mm. stick close. And Lee, be careful. Never without my weapon. No, no, please, no, no, no! Ready, go, go. Run. Oh, uh, I'm gonna take the boy and kick around. No, please don't take my boy! Let's go, woman. I did, I did. Down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Oh. Where are Katja and the kid? Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> but yeah, but... Tommy, let me go! I didn't run! Lee, get back! Don't come in here! You get let her go, Brenda! Lee! Lee, don't you take another step! Brenda, come on now, you know you don't want to do this! Just go away and leave us be! Go, Brenda! 
took easy. Please, please don't you take another step. Brent, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Obviously smart, huh? How did it come to this? Just stop! Please. I don't wanna kill you, Lee! What what <laughs> the staring was your pride! Look what you've done to it! Nice. You ain't shit! <laughs> 
<laughs> it's over! Fuck you! This dude is dead and mama get out here! You... You all fucked! <laughs> They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Here and fight me like a man, Lee. Lee! The mother. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You're no hero. You destroyed two lives in that meat locker. Kenny, you're not a bad man, but fuck. What the hell are we gonna do now? Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? Yes, Walker's probably got them. They were very bad people, and they were punished for it. Okay. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Hello?
figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. And we are fucking hungry. This food could save all of us. Yeah. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Oh, fuck, fuck. We Not have hungry. to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Yeah. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. I'm sorry to be. So sorry to deceive her. Deceive her. It's locked. No shit, I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Supplies? I'll take it. We don't have the choice. More food in here. <laughs> Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. I feel me bad. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody to get this. Understand? I guess so. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? <laughs> You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? <laughs> For the radio. Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Mama, sweetheart, we won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I'm thinking it, you're I'll safe, you know. sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. The people who took. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much faces. It's starting to add up. 
I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! <laughs> Okay. 55 of players stole food. Ah, it was a hard choice. Fuck this. Okay, okay. We will see the next time. I can't let the music after this because of the restriction on YouTube, so it's bad. <laughs> Just for the music of the game, it's bad. Yeah, I know. Okay, so we will playing the next part. If you want, okay, I mean, uh, I will record it. So, yeah, it's uh, really uh, a good game. I like it. So, I see you the next time. I send you big kisses and I wish you a great night or day. Bye bye.